everyone in this video I'm going to create a Citrix site so uh, when you launch Citrix Studio console you get these three options the first one is deliver applications and desktops to your users the second one is remote PC access uh, basically you can allow users to connect to remote physical machines and the third one is uh, uh, connecting to the existing delivery controller if you already have an existing site okay I'm going to click the first one okay it is asking for the name of the site I'll just type it as Mumbai okay I click next I click okay uh, it creates three database three databases the first one is uh, uh, site second one is monitoring and the third one is logging so I just go ahead and click next This will take a minute or two. Let's wait because it's trying to create these databases. All right, so we are on the next option, which is licensing server. So let's try to connect and see how it goes. Okay, seems like it is good. So let's go ahead and click next. All right, it is asking for the IP address of my Zen server host. So I'm going to type the IP address of my Zen server and see how it goes. All right. I will give the username and I will also give the password I'll put the connection as my connection at this moment okay so let's go ahead and click next and see how it goes all right it took me to the next screen which is storage uh, it is asking whether you want to use the storage shared by a couple of hypervisors or you want to use a storage local to the hypervisor since i have only one asx host uh, i'm going to just select use storage local to the hypervisor i just go ahead and click next and see how it goes okay all oh, looks good i'll go ahead and click next all right it is asking for the name of these resources okay i just go ahead and click next once again okay uh, it is asking whether you want to enable these two options app dn and app e publishing for for this lab environment i am not using this so i just go ahead and click next all right uh, so before you click finish you can uh, uh, cross check the details that you have mentioned so these are the details you just cross check once looks good looks good so everything if everything looks good you can uh, just go ahead and click finish so it is going to uh, generate database it's creating database so it's going to take a few minutes so let's wait and see how it goes i'll place this uh, call on hold for a few minutes i'll be on mute thank you
Uh, the site has been uh, created successfully and uh, if you see that it says uh, Citrix Studio Mumbai so uh, the site has been created successfully so I hope you like this video if you have any questions please leave a comment thank you very much